So now I am going to explain you accrued income. See what is accrued income. Let's take an example. Accrued income. See the meaning of accrued income is what? Income earned but not received. Income earned. I worked for the income. I worked to earn the income. I have done the work, but payment is not done. Still, I am waiting for the payment. So, accrued income means income earned but not received. Let's take an example. Suppose this is the building, and uh, in this building I am running my business, and and one part of the building is stair. I am not using that you know one part. So what I did, I let out that uh, spare part on the rental basis. I gave that you know spare part to one of my friends, and how much rent I am charging? Dollar five hundred. So who is my friend? Suppose Mr. Y. I gave him that spare part, spare spare portion of that building. I gave to my friend Mr. Y. And how much rent I will charge to him? Dollar five hundred per month. Okay, so tell me how much rent should I receive from him during the year? Six thousand dollars. But he paid me only five thousand. So it means that how much rent he earned by me, but still not received one thousand. See, total I have to get you know how much for during the year I should get you know six thousand. But he paid me only five thousand. It means. That The remaining rent, you know, dollar one thousand is what? So see, how much how much rent I got? Dollar five thousand, isn't it? I got dollar five thousand. Agree? So see what entry I will pass for that. So I got the money. So cash increase, isn't it? So increase in cash means debit. And uh, rent is my income. So increase in income means credit. Rent received. So it is my income. Yeah, increase in revenue, so, or you can say increase in income means credit. I got the money. So increase in cash, debit. Cash is asset, and rent is rent received is income. So increase in income credit. Now see in the ledger, I will open rent received account. Now in the entry, see rent received account is created. So on its credit side, I will make the post cash. How much amount? Dollar five thousand. Agree? So now see rent received account is showing credit balance. So that credit balance now will appear in the tally. Rent received, and it will appear in the tally balance on the credit side. Five thousand dollar. Now see the rent received is income. So it will come in the income statement, and I will show rent received under head other income. I will show rent received, and how much amount I got? Five thousand dollars. So five thousand I will show you. Rent received five thousand. But the other will not accept this figure because this figure is not related to the whole year. This is related only to the period of ten ten months. So what I need to do? I need to record this one thousand also. This is you know income and but is still not received. So I I need to pass entry for this. So so tell me what adjustment entry should I pass? So you you tell me here I need to increase the income account or I need to decrease the income? Yeah, I need to increase the income, isn't it? So to increase the income, what should I do? I I should credit the income account. So you say na increase in income credit. So it means I need to to increase the income account. Right now it is at five thousand, but I need to bring this account at six thousand, isn't it? So to increase the income account, I need to credit the income account. So I will credit the income account. And what is the income here? Rent receipt. I will credit the rent received account with a dollar one. Okay, so this is my income account, and now uh, I will debit this account accrued rent. Accrued rent account. I will debit this account. Accrued rent account. How much dollar? One thousand dollar. Now I have to show the effect of this adjustment. 
SC rank received here created with thousand dollars. So here I will uh, uh, write that. Here I will increase my income. Approved rank. And how much amount? One thousand dollars. So here I will write how much amount? Six thousand. So I will added one thousand here because of what? Because in the adjacent entry income account is credited. And the rules uh, whenever income in credit it means income is increasing. So that's why I increase the income account. Now income will come in the profit and loss account with dollar six. And this accrued rent is my asset because because I will be you know getting this uh, dollar one thousand in near future. So this is my asset. So it will come in the balance sheet under head current assets. Accrued rent. It will come in the asset set. Here we dollar one thousand. 